Hey girl, hey, it's your girl Jay Lachey and welcome back to my channel. Hey girls. Okay, so in today's video, I got this little concept that I want to start doing on my channel and I've been doing it in real life, but I had stopped doing it. And I really want to pick it back up, but I want to start doing it with you guys. So I want to start incorporating this every Sunday in my videos. Um, today is obviously not Sunday, but starting in November, Jayvember. <laughs> It will be a thing for every Sunday. All right, so I know today is not Sunday. Today is actually Saturday, but I work tomorrow and I'm still in Vlogtober. But this is the last Sunday of the month. I mean, the last Saturday of the month. So starting next Sunday, the first Sunday of November and moving forward every single Sunday, no matter what kind of video I have, whether it's a makeup video, a cooking video, a weekly vlog, a daily vlog, a Sunday reset. Um, trying something new, I'm doing PR unboxing, whatever I have going on, it will always be incorporated in a Sunday video. So I want to call it Pour Into Yourself Sunday. Um, Pour Into Yourself Sunday for me means, y'all know, I just feel like growing up, we always on Sundays cleaned our room, did our homework, um, did our chores, if it was the kitchen, the dishes, the whatever the case. Um, we ate our food at a certain time. We went to bed. We got back up. Um, went to school and we started on with our week. That was just that. As adults, you know, I feel like a lot of people have transferred that over and started doing it into their own homes with their kids. On Sundays, you run into the grocery store to get what you need for dinner. Um, you run to grab whatever y'all gonna need for the week. You trying to make sure the kids' uniforms and stuff is washed. They for school or for whatever activities they may be in. You trying to make sure lunch is going to be made for if you got to make lunch for the kids. You know, you just got a busy life on Sundays. On Sundays, I feel like you running around, you cleaning up, and you try to get them kids, make sure their homework is done, their hair is combed, the boys got a haircut, their baths is done, everything is in their backpack. Everything is set up for Monday. By the time you finish all of that for Sunday, you have not had no time for you. So now you're exhausted. You're over it. You might pour you a glass of wine. You got to go to work the next morning, so you probably ain't taking no shot. You probably just drinking you some wine. Um, but all that you poured into somebody else and everybody else's needs. But when did you pour into you? And I feel like the problem is... We don't really pour into us. We don't have time to pour into us because we are so focused all the time pouring into other people. Your kids, your man, your woman, your friends. You can always be a good person to other people, but you lack being a good person to yourself. And this might not, this video might not apply to everybody. And if it don't apply to you, you can go ahead and come on up off of it now. Thank you for the time you spent on here. But if this applies to you, then girl, you know what I'm talking about. So, in this pour into your Sunday, I want to start back doing my sticky notes. So, I picked up me some sticky notes from Walmart the other day when y'all seen me doing the Christmas decor video. I was showing y'all all the Christmas stuff. I walked past them and I was like, sticky notes. I need to give me some sticky notes. On my wall over here, I have different stuff like, oh, love on real moment. But, y'all know I had two ectopic pregnancies. Um, I lost both kids. So, I put their names because I did name my kids. Um, a more means love. Um, that was seven, eight, fifteen, and then Nevea means heaven backwards, nine, ten, twenty. So I did put those down on sticky notes because I just never want to forget. And I feel like as life go on, you start to forget the traumatic things that happen in your life, or things that happen around that time because something traumatic happened. I put you are not less than angel mom. Uh, focus, focus, focus. Boss friends, because I always said I wanted some friends that was just some badass bosses, like y'all on top of y'all stuff. Create my website, which I've done. The website been up for a long time. Get more organized. I still ain't did it yet. Maybe I need to put it in pink. I am the bag because that's just something I need to tell myself. Don't settle. Trust, peace, secure myself. I am the table. Self-love. I have Bible scriptures up there. Different things that I just feel like I needed to tell myself. Now, I didn't come up with this idea of sticky notes and putting them on my wall. I used to watch Be and Mary Jane. I loved Be and Mary Jane. Comment down below right now if you watch Be and Mary Jane. If you didn't, girl, go go watch it. It don't come on no more, but go watch the seasons that still that did come out because it was so damn good. I I don't understand why it ended, and I'm really pressed about that. But um, Mary Jane used to put her Gabrielle Union because that's the that's who the actress was. 
actor was actor actress i don't know that's who she was um playing in that show and she used to write all these positive things on sticky notes and stick them on her refrigerator on her water bottle on her mirror in her bathroom on her vanity on her doors like all type of stuff like that just to remind herself positive things and so i started doing it because i feel like i needed to and i really enjoyed it but i don't know somewhere along the lines life and pouring into other people took over me pouring into myself and I want to get back to it. So I feel like Sundays is the best day to do it because that's the day you're like, oh, Lord Jesus. Another week finna start. Here come Monday. Pour into yourself something positive before that week start. Do it before you go to bed at night. Put it on your iPad timer, your phone timer, on your watch, whatever you need. Make it a timer. And I want you to take that five, ten minutes, whatever, and be intentional with it. And write something positive different. Because whatever the biggest negative thing happened last week and you beat yourself up about it. Oh, I'm so dumb. Why did I do that? Oh, I'm so stupid. Why can't I get my life together? Why am I not doing this yet? Why am I not here yet? Take that negativity and find a way to turn it around to a positive way for you to think about it for the next upcoming week. So today, even though it's not Sunday, I want to go ahead and start. Um, I want to start the week off. I work tomorrow. I'm still going to do me another one tomorrow. But for the purpose of the video, I'm going to do that one with you guys. So, I felt like I was defeated this week. I felt defeated. I felt like, oh my gosh, I'm just running in circles. I still haven't recuperated from this past weekend of Babe's birthday and all the, the, the craziness with that. And this why X, Y, and Z. I felt like I just haven't been able to recuperate and snap back to it. So, mine that I want to write is, and I probably put something cute on the screen, a sticky note of me typing, even though I'm writing. But on mine, I want to say, this is what it look like. My handwriting ugly, I ain't finna show it to y'all. But it say, you are bigger than the trials you may face. Because I feel like, in life we get a lot of trials and we get a lot of tribulations. And I want to remind myself that I'm bigger than the trials I might face. And I want to stick it on my mirror of my vanity because I feel like every time I come here to record, that damn camera did. All the batteries did. The, the light did go on top of the camera did, which is why I got the ring lights sitting off to the side. Or I'm frustrated. I'm rushing because I'm trying to keep up with this vlogtober. And I really don't want to give in. I don't want to make it all the way to the end of the month. And that's when I stop recording. That's when I stop posting for vlogtober. This is my first vlogtober and... It, it's been okay. <laughs> um, I really wanted it to do better, but it's things that I could have worked on to make it do better. But this is also my first month back working. I haven't had a job, a nine to five in six, seven years. I just been doing my business thing and I decided to hop back into the work field and still do my business stuff. So, by the way, YouTube, her merch. Mm -hmm. And I'm dropping something for Wine Down Wednesday. I'm thinking of something for this pour into yourself, but I kind of want to say pour into your cup. Pour into your cup. Because that's what I feel like we're doing. We pour in, you taking this cup and you're pouring it to your friend. And you're pouring it to your man. And you're pouring it to your kids. And you're pouring it to your job. And you're pouring it to this person. You're pouring it to that. You're pouring it to the bills. Who is taking something and pouring it back in your cup? And if nobody, if you feel like people, you got people to support you. And they say positive things to you and all of that other stuff. When are you going to take time to pour into you? You have to take time to pour into yourself just as well. If you don't pour into yourself, how can you expect others to? So, yeah, you're, you are bigger than the trials you may face. And I am. Because it seemed hard now and it seemed like a lot to adjust to now. But at the end of the day, I'm going to see through. It's going to get better. I'm going to find a way to make it get better. And I don't want to never forget that. So tomorrow I'm going to write a different one for my upcoming week. Because it's going to be a crazy work week. And trying to get through Friday. Thursday is the last day of freaking October. The last day of October, And we can go back to regular programming <laughs> with these videos. Um, and then I can try to adjust and get better in November for, before Vlogmas starts. But I have a better plan when Vlogmas starts versus coming into Vlogtober. This is my first time ever trying to do videos every day for a month. I mean, things was going to happen. But now I have learned from them and I know what to do when Vlogmas start. So, yeah, that's pretty much what I want to say because I don't want to get too emotional because I felt like I was going to get there. But I don't want to get too emotional. We're going to take this moment and just bring something positive into our life. And if you don't know what to write on your sticky note, 
just make sure you, you can get you a pack. And some of the things that I say may may work for you. And you might can write that on your sticky note. I don't know, but pour into yourself Sundays is something I really want to start. So you guys join me on it or just come and watch my journey as I try to build myself up and pour into myself and believe in myself. And it won't be easy. It's going to be some days I'm like, fuck that sticky note. Shit, life, life, and that sticky note ain't finna do nothing for me. It might be some days where I feel like that, but in reality, I'm not gonna stop. And I'm gonna just keep buying another pack, and they'll be all over my office and my wall. They'll be on the refrigerator. I used to write them um, and leave them on the back of the door for my back, my man so he can see them before going to work, but then I fell off from doing that. Just something positive to pour into my man as well. Because, you know, men don't really vent to nobody. So, and they don't tell you it, all of it because they don't want to be looked at or seen as weak. So, I want to start doing that back for him too. I need to buy some blue ones or some red ones or something. He ain't getting any pink ones. But for now, look at me trying to pour into somebody else again. I'm trying to take the moment that I should be pouring into me only and trying to find a way that I can pour into somebody else still. And I'm not going to do that. We're going to make this about me. Maybe later down the line when I'm consistent with doing this for a while. And I, I might do that. But for now, we're going to make this about Jay. Because Jay looks Jay deserves for her cup to be filled as well. So, yeah. I hope you guys are enjoying this uh, Saturday. Today's Saturday, right? Yeah. Hope you guys are enjoying this Saturday. Hope y'all safe. If y'all go out and have fun tonight, have fun for me too. Because, baby, I got to be up at 4 in the morning for work. Okay. So, tomorrow is Sunday. I didn't try to say that sentence like seven times. But I keep saying Saturday. Tomorrow is Sunday. So, I will be pouring into my cup again tomorrow in Vlogtober. The Vlogtober video. But I want to come and drop this today so you guys can have time to go get you a pack of these from Family Dollar, Dollar Tree, Walmart, Mines was 98 cent. I'll get you a pack of these. You already got an ink pen. These actually came from over there from my, uh, my desk that I use to sit down and write stuff down for orders. But you got a pack of pens. Or if you don't, get you a pack while you're getting these. That's $2. Get you a marker. You got something you're right with. Get one of them baby's crayons. But... Get you some sticky notes. You have a day. It's pretty early still. You can still get them. You can even get them in the morning while you are getting your groceries and stuff. And you can start going your notes right now. Or the things you got to pick up from the store tomorrow. And go and add it in your notes so you can go and grab it tomorrow. Or you can do it tomorrow. And when you see this video, you can when I write mine out, you can write yours out. We can do them together every Sunday. If you feel like you're going to be forgetting that to do it, every Sunday I will be dropping. I'm going to drop something every Sunday just because I want to make sure we are all doing this. But, now I ain't gonna lie to y'all. Vlog October in, y'all ain't getting no video Friday. Saturday, I'm gonna do my, my sticky note Sunday. But then we gonna go back to regular programming on just two long forms a week. But make sure y'all checking out the shorts tab on my channel as well. Because for Jay Vember, up until my birthday, I will be dropping a short every day. <laughs> we sticking with that consistency, baby. We trying to get my tags. We trying to get us a coin. We trying to get bigger than big. But I will see you guys in the next freaking video.